Now, speaking of China, it's time now for some Wuhan virus updates. In the last 24 hours, 358 new cases have emerged. 300 of them were reported in Kerala. In Kerala. The total cases in India have now gone up to 2,669. Out of them, 2,341 are in Kerala alone. There have been six new deaths due to COVID. Three in Kerala, two in Karnataka and one in Punjab. As you know, a new COVID subvariant is in town. It's the JN.1 Omicron subvariant. So far, it has been confirmed in 19 test samples in Goa and one each in Kerala and Maharashtra. As you can see, the South Indian state of Kerala continues to be a Wuhan virus hotspot. So what is the government doing about it? Well, for starters, the state health department has ramped up COVID-19 testing. All hospitals with inpatient facilities have been asked to keep a COVID ward ready in case of any emergency. One good news is that hospitalization rates have not, have not increased despite the rise in cases. Majority of current active cases are at home with mild symptoms. Still, almost 2,000 oxygen beds, 2,500 ICU beds and about 1,000 ventilator ICU beds are ready to meet any kind of emergency. As for the new subvariant, Goa has reported the highest number of cases. The JN.1 cases were detected through genome sequencing. Most of them were reported from North Goa area. This may be of co a cause of concern for Goa, which is usually buzzing during the holiday season. You see, it happens to be a popular tourist destination. People from across the world visit Goa this time of year to celebrate Christmas and New Year's. The state authorities have said, however, that there was no need to panic yet but some officials have still called for cancellation of upcoming events. This includes the Sunburn Music Festival, among others. The state government is yet to issue COVID guidelines. So, to sum it up, the situation is not severe so far, but it is alarming. We've been telling you this for a few days now. Take care of your personal hygiene. Wash your hands frequently. Avoid, touch, avoid touching your nose and mouth. And if you are in the vulnerable group, avoid crowded places altogether. And most importantly, reach out for your masks once again. Beyond World is One is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news updates on the move.